Hello and welcome my lovelies. Uh, my name is Schman, Schmonster, and today I am bringing you a team builder from, for the MPBL. And yeah, so first off, this is a new league. This is a, uh, a multi-battle league, a little bit like the MBL. Well, actually, almost completely the same, but not with the members of the MBL, <laughs> simply put. So, um, we, I partnered up with Devovo. For those who don't know him, he's uh, a regular at Duncan Knee Deep's channel with the Free For Alls, if you don't know him. He has his own Twitch, which will be linked down below. He streams himself playing Hearthstone sometimes. Uh, he also has a Twitter, you can also follow that. And that's pretty much it. Yes, he's a very great guy. I'm very happy to work together with him. And uh, we've decided to come together and be a team. Yes, that's pretty much shit. So uh, this video will be like a team announcement plus team building video. Uh, the Vovo isn't here right now because um, we actually already did our first week's match and we haven't gotten to do this and I had to make this video and I didn't really want to bother him with it, with it and stuff but like you see I'm just gonna do it here uh, but you'll see him in the next video where we're battling. So. <coughs> So, first week, we've got the janitors. First off, this is not the official logo, this is the logo that I made for them. Uh, well, quickly, because they're still being commissioned, so they could use it for now. Uh, but this is our logo, Kung Fury, uh, a reference to the movie. If you haven't seen it, look at the short movie, it's very fun. First off, I'll go over the draft and the decisions which team, uh, why we decided to bring some mons. Because the rule is this, simply said, is uh, the Vovo brings four mons, I bring four mons. But we've got a total of 10 different Pokemon. So we've got to decide which one we're gonna bring, which not. And uh, we've got some very nice picks if I may so, so myself. So, uh, we've divided, I've divided them already uh, for so you can clearly see which team, well, which tier which one is. We've got our S tier was the Urachi, uh, we've got our A tier, our Heatran and Bulu, Tefu Bulu. Our C tier picks are Mega, uh, it's just really good, it's not Mega, uh, Drampa and the Hariyama. We've got our Selgo, we've got the Crawdont, we've got the Illumis and the Mr. Mime. So, quickly set, I'll go over quickly why we picked those, why we liked it. So, uh, first we went with the Heatran Bulu core, we liked it. We like Bulu very much, and uh, Bulu as Selgor is something very nice to have, certainly just unburdened. Final Gamut is nice to have, and Bulu was a little bit more supportive than Coco. Coco was an S tier, so we decided to have uh, Bulu to help our Heatran. Uh, we've, dis we've switched some things up a lot, but uh, yeah. So we, we really want to tackle and we like those mons and we know how to use them as well. So it's very nice to have. Our uh, S tier pick was Yurachi because Yurachi really is, uh, really knows everything about everything. Like Doom Desire, Future Side, got, can, you can go physical, you can go scarf with it, you can go special with it, Calm Mindset, you can go follow me even, which is very nice certainly in doubles battles. Uh, you've got Icy Wind, you've got Trick Room. You've got a lot of options actually, just that. And that's why we really liked it. It's also great typing. And we really liked it and chose to pick that up as well because it's just that good. Uh, next to Yurachi, we've got another Follow Mirror, which is uh, Mr. Mime. And I, re I really do like Mr. Mime because it was a pick that I like to make. Because it also gets Fake Out, Follow Me, it gets White God, it gets Icy Wind, gets Trick Room, gets a lot of stuff. And yeah, I really wanted to use Mr. Mime, I can't lie. Uh, our Mr. Meme, yeah. And yeah, so that's why we decided to have it. We've got, well, we've got. Uh, Illumise as well. Illumise is just there for pranks to Tailwind, which is very nice. Light Skin, Reflect, uh, even just encoring stuff. It's just that annoying mon that you have to watch out for if you're not prepping for it or if you are ignoring it. If you choose to protect on something, uh, Illumise will make sure you are stuck in protect with its encore. This can be very annoying. We've got Crawlon, just a hard hitting mon which can work both in Tailwind and in Trick Room. Which we very much like. It's a C tier pick, but it it just hits so hard thanks to the adaptability. 
Uh, and yeah, that's why we really liked it and picked that up as well. We next up we got Gyarados. Gyarados is like it's just it's just a good mod. It's got Dragon S, it's got Intimidate, it's got Moxie even. It's just yeah, it's a mod you have to prep for. If you don't prep for it, it can be very dangerous as well. We've got uh, the Berserker himself, we've got uh, Snoop Dogg, I forgot its name, that's why I'm referencing all the other stuff. Drampa, we've got Drampa. Drampa, we've chose Drampa because we like to have a dragon typing. Uh, it's also a special one, uh, which is very nice. Gets Roost as well, gets a lot of coverage, gets Icy Wind, gets uh, Tailwind as well. And yeah, the option to even Roost and some other things that we like to run. Uh, one day certainly in this league and we really liked it and uh, so we picked that up as well and Lastly we picked up the Hariyama. Hariyama is just a good mom. Hard hitting mom. It's bulky. It's very good in trick room. It has fake out as well uh, Just a good fighting type actually uh, get, Also gets the ability to have some guarding moves, which is also very nice to have So I'll go uh, Next we'll I'll show you the team of the Janitors they chose to pick uh, Dark Ray, which is a very, very scary mon. Uh, Dark Void is nerfed and is only 50% accurate, but they've got Victini, which makes it 55% uh, more accurate, which is dangerous. Uh, no, but like, it's it's still a scary mon. Like, even without the Dark Void, Dark Void, you can still use it. Like, 50% on two mons is not that bad. Uh, then we've got Nagana Dell. Uh, Tailwind, Sludge Bomb, it just it has the ability to sweep about everything uh, if, it, if it, uh, you let it. So it can be very dangerous. Yeah, and Victini is just that mon that also gets Final Gambit. Uh, 100 base all around stats can do about everything that you want it to do. So that's also very nice to have. Even Z Celebrate, yes, you can run Z Celebrate in this league, which is very nice. We can run that too with our Urochi. Uh, then the, we've got the. B tier picks, which is, which is the Oranguru. Oranguru, yeah, it's just a good trick rumor. Also has Instruct, also very nice to have, certainly. Uh, then they got Hypnotop, Intimidate, White God, Fake Out, Faint, all that stuff, which is very nice. Superior is also quite nice because uh, you like to play with Hazards, and if someone tries to bring Sticky Web, uh, it only gets a boost. Leaf Storm just hit, also hit, can hit hard after a few times. Uh, contrary is just nice to have. And then their follow mirror is the Electivire. Electivire is a good mon. Uh, you can run special, physical, actually choose what you want to do. And the follow me helps a lot in the team. Then they've got Tentacruel. Tentacruel is just a mon that you also have to prep for because yeah, it's got acid, it has acid spray, can get knockoff. It's yeah, it's just a good mon. Clearly. As a CT pick, and one of the scariest CT picks in my opinion is the Mega Arduino. Arduino is a bulky mod and if you are on one side and you can't deal with it, the Arduino, you're fucked because like it gets Calmite, it's very bulky, it gets Wish, uh, Tango, it doesn't get Moonblast but it does get Dazzling Gleam. So it can be very, and it gets a lot of coverage as well, so it's a very dangerous mod. And then last but not least, they've picked the Eevee. Eevee is just a mod that you have to prep for because Eevee and Z uh, you can use that, it, it, you, you are able to use that and um, you have to prep for it. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, so, I'm going to show you the two teams. The team above is of course our own. Oh wow, it's quite lagging a bit, the images. Can't help it, uh, probably because uh, there are more images to come. But yeah, I'm just going to show it. So we t decided to pick, on my side, Heatran. Uh, Drampa, uh, Mr. Mime and Estelgo and the Vovo side, the Yirachi, the Hariyama, uh, the Illumis and the Crawdont. Uh, wow, it really is buggy. Uh, but first off, so on uh, the this, uh, the Hariyama is an Assault Fest set with Close Combat, Faint, Stomping Time and Fake Out. Uh, close Combat just hitting about everything, Faint is very nice to have certainly to block some ones from protecting. Fake out is always good to have, and Stomping Tantrum hits the uh, Tentacruel Heart, hits the Victini, hits the Nagana Del, which is just nice to have. Uh, then we've got the Yurachi. Yurachi is a very special defensive set 
with the Oka Berry. It can live a Dark Pulse, it can live a Z, uh, it can live a Fire Z from the Nagana Dell. It lives pretty much everything, and that's what we wanted because we wanted to have something to be sorted to get up that Trick Room. We gave it Zen Habit as well, we've, got, we've given it Drain Punch as well just to be able to hit that Dark Ray as well. And yeah, the Okaberry just helps a lot, uh, certainly versus that Nagana Dell and Victini just to get out that Trick Room. It also has Follow Me, uh, and as you noticed, we've got Mr. Mime with us as well, uh, but I'll go there in a bit. We've got the Illumis with Likely, not even Focus Sash, because uh, their team is very much special oriented, and so we've got Faked It, uh, we've got Light Screen, which helps us a lot versus their team because uh, of their special threats actually. Uh, they, we've got Fake Tears just to drop special defense, we've got Tailwind just to get our Tailwind up and Helping Hand just to give that little bit more effort to help uh, my side a little bit more by KOing some mounts. Next up we've got the Crawdon. Crawdon is just there to hit stuff hard. It's a Life Orb, Adaptility one, we've got Liquidation, Aqua Jet, Knock Off and Protect. Uh, fully full HP, full attack element, of course, uh, just to hit about everything hard. And yeah, so that's why I don't have, really have to explain any more, anything more about that. Then my side, we've got the Heatran. Heatran is just a leftover set, quite special defense, uh, well, quite bulky, like a lot of HP. Uh, uh, got speed, got it has enough speed to underspeed the Electrifier, but. Uh, but to outspeed the hitmon top, stuff like that. Like we were very careful calcs like that. Uh, we've got flash cannon, we've got heat wave, we've got earth power and protect, just to hit about everything really. So uh, just hard hitting mon, we like that. We've got the Asalgo. We have instant plate Asalgo with sticky hold, because uh, we were thinking about running on burden, but we were thinking like they're not gonna run the scarf mom or anything. We're just gonna uh, bring final gambit, struggle bug, bug burst, protect, just to be certain so we can kill the dark ray. Final gambit kills about everything and protect to protect us for fake out struggle bug just to drop some special attacks, which is also very important. Certainly, this is team we're battling against. There's all the special attackers. Then we've got the drampa with icy wind, dragon pulse, stall, and roost uh, with the citrus berry. We're also Sap Zipper just for the superior, but it's just more support than anything else. But it's uh, it can kill the Nagana Dao with Dragon Pulse from any range, which is very nice to have. Um, and yeah, it's quite special defensive bulky as well, which is very nice versus their team, because uh, most of their hard hitters are special. So yeah, that's our team. I uh, I hope you like it. Uh, we're going to the next slide. Yeah. So, oh, I forgot. Hey, so this is our uh, squad. And uh, yeah, I've put the Twitter links and the Twitch links for the Vovo. Do give him a follow, he's really worth it. And I've just put my Twitter here again, because my Twitch is always linked here down below. So, uh, do look out for our battles. The battle is probably gonna go up tomorrow uh, or maybe sooner. But uh, I'll still have to decide that. In any way, I hope you enjoyed. And do leave a like. And do support your Kung Fury. Bye.